adventure. Welcome back to Queenie of London and welcome back to Vlogmas Day 21. I'm so excited. I have come down the King's Road a little bit later after work today with my mum and we're first of all going to pop into the gorgeous Chelsea Gardener. I told you I would do it and I'm doing it now. So we're going to have a lovely look around and see what they've got just before the big day it's going to be so gorgeous in here i hope you enjoy it then afterwards who knows what we're going to get up to but i'm sure we'll get up to something fun so let's go in just before i do should we have a little look at their sneaky window displays here just in case i miss anything <gasps> i'm loving the hanging tinsel yeah have we got any more down here there's a nice little cafe in here. It's very, very pretty. And I saw a sign which suggests they still have some real Christmas trees. Yeah, so we'll pop in. Oh, how lovely this is. It's all illuminated, pretty. It's like a little cabin off the King's Road. Okay, let's go feel magical. <laughs> Where have you gone? Have you seen all these? Look at the banana. I love this song. Gosh, guys, look at all these. Oh, I feel like I'm back in September again. <laughs> Keep your eyes out for a frog with a crown for me. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at all, have you seen all this? Look at the sign. Isn't this magical? Yeah. Did you see these little villages? Yeah, I know, but I like these too. Look at these waves. We'll put it on the mantle. Mm -hmm. What did 
I miss you. Here around the front, this centre one. I just like the way it was done, like a train. Like a train. Oh my gosh, I can see some big polar bears. Look at this. Oh my God, look at this. Look, it's like a cork. Look. I love that. with their wings outstretched. They freaked me a bit. <laughs> when I was little, I went to a pet shop and they had a parrot in there. He wasn't for sale, he was just there. And he spoke quite a lot and he also swore. <laughs> I know I love the apples. I've seen this bear in Selfridges. I'm coming through in a minute. Oh, what's that? Look at the little church. I love the little church. Look at them reeves. I think I went a bit too fast because <laughs> I got excited again. I'm going to go back here. Look, I looked at that one quite thoroughly, didn't I, guys? Everything's got crowns on. It's so pretty. He's different, I like him. And I um, would really like a telephone box in my garden. <gasps> hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Look, he's glitzy. The tree's coming out of the telephone box. I'm obsessed. I love that. And um, just as an aside, look at that show me. <gasps> So happy. What's here? Look. There's some reeves over there that I haven't shown you. We'll go over there. This is amazing. I might go and see what my mum's found in the garden bit out there. Oh my god, I love that white berry one. There. That's wowzers. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. 
I'm just going to find Mama. Look at the little wheelbarrow. Still got some trees. Isn't this so pretty? Love to decorate this reef. <gasps> Such fun I'd have. I love him. So lovely. Look at the stars. So pretty in here. I'm feeling inspired for next year, guys. <laughs> we are just going to nip into gorgeous anthropology and see what they got. Because look, it says my favourite word. <laughs> we'll see what's in here. Let me check the windows first, just in case I see anything I like in the windows. Oh, the trousers. And the little penguins. Let's have a nosy, shall we? This is such a beautiful shop and it always smells amazing. Look how gorgeous this shop is. <gasps> oh, they're like ice skates. So cute. Oh my god, look. Oh. oh, it's like a puffer coat. They look atrocious on me. <laughs> Everybody wears puffers around here. They're really in. I don't like them. <gasps> are these actual books? Yes, they are in a box. What's up there? These are like proper good coffee table books, aren't they, guys? Oops. <laughs> in Waterstones, and they have these 
these gorgeous cards with all the local points of interest on. Look, the fountain at Stone Square. It was Kensington Palace. So lovely. You can find good things in local shops. We'll have a little nosy about Waterstones. I'm looking for a diary. Always come to Waterstones for cards. Look, the boat race from the London Transport Museum the other day. And I love these and the New Yorker ones. Look. How amazing are these? This one's lovely. We'll wait until we look at the Christmas cards. It's a bit busy. <laughs> How gorgeous are these for children? Look, the history of music for children and the history of words for children. They're lovely illustrated as well. Brilliant Christmas books. That cover, never judge and all that, but it looks good. <laughs> just in that scribbler, what does that remind you of? The Selfridges window. <laughs> Look at these little guys. We're looking for cards still. <laughs> they always have quite funny cards in here, like that Claws Are Worth It one. Oh, here's Jesus again. <laughs> it's my brother's humour in here. <laughs> Look at this one. <laughs> we are in the top floor restaurant in Peter Jones's, and I don't know if you're just getting a heck load of reflection from me, but you can see um, Winter Wonderland from there. And then Pavilion Road with the lights down there, with the crisscross lights, and the one right in the middle, that's Winter Wonderland. Can you see? I don't know if I could zoom it if it'd go really, really funny. <gasps> there you go. Woo! How cool is that? And then over there, you get nice views from up here. How fun! Hi everybody, so I'm back home in my pyjamas and all cosy again now. I'm just sat down at my desk and I have a lovely cuppa in me Mrs. Claus mug. I had to get it from Anthropology. She was too cute to leave behind. After we went to Peter Jones's for our tea and cake, uh, we just made a little start on the Christmas food shop. We'll probably do that in a couple of stages and I think the main bit's being done tomorrow. So I'll probably take you along for a little bit of that to see the trolley getting fuller and fuller. That will be fun. I like the Christmas food shop. What's not to love about stuffing balls and pigs in blankets and parsnips? Mmm lovely so for the rest of the evening i'm gonna do a little bit more wrapping but before i do can't resist gonna put my nose into the christmas edition of the spectator i love the spectator i read it mostly online every week but i do buy some of the ones with the covers that i love because i can't resist them sometimes but this is this year's offering it's pretty cool I do like it so I'm looking forward to reading that it's got a lot of writers who have contributed to this year's so that'll be good this one I thought I'd show you <laughs> this one is from 2020 I think this is so fun it was perfect for the time perfectly represented the political climate in the UK that was a good addition and the final one I wanted to show you is this one this one wasn't christmas but it commemorated their 10,000th issue i find that really hard to say um i love it because they've got all period costume on 
throughout the years the spectator's been going and they're reading their magazine so how fun is that i was so excited when that came out i thought it was brilliant but yeah i like old magazines i like keeping magazines that's just me so i'm gonna <laughs> enjoy reading that finish my brew and then do me wrapping until tomorrow my lovelies i hope you have a lovely evening thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the little trip to the chelsea gardener today and i look forward to speaking with you all tomorrow lots of love from london queenie and mrs claus